So good morning. Today is the day of our first track meet of the season in the Southern Athletics League. Just here with Luke. We've come down to Colchester. What races are you doing today, mate? I'm in the eight and the four. So eight fun. and four. It's got an hour between them. Uh, I'm doing the 3K today, so it should be good. And then after my race down here this morning, we're heading down to London to the night of the 10,000 PB. So yeah, gonna kickstart my track season with a 3K today. Um, it'd be a bit of a line in the sand, see where I'm at at the moment after sort of all the marathon training I've been doing over the last few months. And then hopefully as the season progresses, I can take a little bit more time off off the 3k time that I lay down today but um yeah we're just heading into to Colchester Stadium this is actually where I used to train when I lived in Colchester for the first meet of the Southern Athletics League so we're competing today against uh, a few other clubs we've got Windsor, Brighton, Weir Chelmsford we've competed against Colchester and a few other teams so yeah should be a good day good day of racing and then tonight is the real spectacle down at London for the night of the 10,000. Make a little song for that. <laughs> We're at the home turf, aren't we? <laughs> Old home turf. Old home turf. Luke's just about to race in about eight minutes. Um, so we've done a bit of a warm up. Let me show you my shoes today. Oh, to be wearing these puppies. And as you can see, my nails match my shoes because I heard from Philly Bowden that if you get your nails matching your shoes, you're gonna run faster. I had to give it a try today. <laughs> Look at that. Perfect match. That's it mate, back to the well on. That's it, match the move now mate, that's it. Good job Luke, let's go! Well done Luke, good job mate. So it looks like Luke was a little bit unlucky there. Um, coming with uh, sort of 200 metres to go, he got tripped up uh, and lost his stride a bit. So didn't quite uh, have the finish that I think he was hoping for. He good finished stuff, third. Mate. What happened there? So the cut up at 200 to yeah. go. He moved out. Yeah. Totally cut me. I went oh, off no. stride. How are you feeling? I'm good. A little bit nervous. Never really know who's going to be here at these sort of events. So we'll see. I'm just going to do a hard, honest effort today. Um, see where I see where I get, end up. It is a little bit windy, Ben. Yeah, I'm glad it's entertaining. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> got all the family here to see. <laughs> well done. Yes. How are you feeling? Not bad. Is that a good run? Just slow, just time. What, slower than you expected? A little bit. But it's a good race. So we have just arrived at the night of the 10,000 PBs. Um, just come straight from my track race. And there's already a race going on now. It's absolutely crazy. The atmosphere is wild. If we just have a look over here, I'm currently stood on a bridge, which literally is going over the track. So yeah, never been to a track event like it. It's going to be absolutely incredible evening. Wow, atmosphere is crazy. Um, people are here. On, on the track watching um, all the way up to lane three which is just incredible you never see this sort of stuff in uh, in track racing before behind me here you've got how many laps are to go so the ladies who are currently running at the moment have got 16 laps to go um, but yeah insane event behind me here is a clock which tells us 
Uh, they're lot, sort of like lap splits, they're kilometre splits. Um, so yeah, it's a really spectator friendly uh, environment. Um, yeah, don't, don't really know what else to say apart from absolute crazy atmosphere so far and it's only going to get crazier as the night goes on. So we've just come into the lap tunnel. It is so loud in here. I've got no idea if you can still hear me, but the ladies are just coming through. Um, they're about to go through 5k. It's the first ladies track race of the evening. It's crazy. Unbelievable. So I just met up with Cole, uh, he raced earlier, unfortunately I wasn't here when you raced, um, but how did it go? It went really really well, almost perfection, yeah. so close, but I wouldn't change a thing about the race, I ran my heart out um, and rolled the dice, which is not typically my, my sort of style, I like yeah. to play it safe. I heard you went to the front pretty early on and just yeah. went for it basically. So I wanted to make it to 5k, nice yeah. and comfortable, because it's, you know, it's 25 laps, it's yeah. pretty crawling. Yeah. Um, so I got to 5k um, and then about 6k, the pace started to slow, yeah. so I just went around the leader, the pace was dropped out, yeah. and then I was like, well, I can't slow down now, I've yeah. got to just keep going, so Amazing. I, I, I took a risk, yeah. and it almost paid off. Will we, will we see you here the next year? Oh, I hope so, definitely. I think yeah. we should try and get all the YouTubers down next year. Yeah. I've already done a bit of networking. Yeah, so, uh, a bit like a YouTuber race on or something like that. Do, yeah. do. We all have to run around with our cameras or something. Yeah, yeah. team YouTube. Yeah, that'll be good. Anyway. Yeah, good to see you, bro. All right. I'm good, I'm glad it went well. Uh, Thank you very much. I'll catch you soon. I think we've got about half an hour now until the elite races start, so the atmosphere's heating up a little bit, everyone's getting some food, some beers. I'm already losing my voice, it's absolutely crazy, but yeah, what an, what an insane environment for, for track racing, but yeah, check this out. So look who I've just bumped into. It's only Philly Bowden. We're doing some content. And Dan the man. <laughs> How's it going, guys? It's good. We're having a great time, aren't we? Are you enjoying yourself so far? Yeah. It's uh, it's electric. It and is pretty I crazy. Think this is probably record attendance because it's not even been the A races yet. And yeah. There's, you can't even see a patch of grass. It's just packed. Yeah, it's it absolutely packed. rammed. Last year for probably the like the A races. So like I can't imagine what the like the atmosphere is going to be like later on this evening. It's yeah. Intense. Yeah. It's but, pretty electric. Also, what do you think of my uh, of my nails? They look fast. They do look fast. Almost, almost ran a PB. That's a PB bar. Yeah. yeah. Did, they match, did they match the shoes? They match the shoes, yeah. The shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I made sure. You did follow the instructions? I followed the instructions, yeah. yeah. Here we go. And the elite ladies are off. There's so many of them on the track. for a bit of behind the scenes access. We've got all the photographers here. We're just lining up uh, just past the finish line. Uh, the ladies are, have got about one or two laps to go. Uh, and yeah, this is our view. It's gonna be pretty crazy. There's gonna be fireworks, the lot. So yeah, pretty cool spot. Insane atmosphere. It's just honestly, I've never seen anything like it. Incredible. Woo! Fireworks are starting. Let's go! Woo! Go on, son! There she goes. She's only gone and done it in 29.58. Sub 30. Insane. And Jess Judd takes the win in the British Champs by the look of things. Amazing running. 
just ahead of Sam Harrison. Great run, around 31 minutes for those ladies. There we go. This is how you put on an event. This is how you do it. Incredible. So many photographers, content creators from all around the world. You've got Alex Felitti here. You've got Curated for Runners, literally Pro Direct, Sports Shoes. Everyone is here. So yeah, incredible event from Night at the 10Ks. And that was just the women's race. We've got the men's to look forward to now. Here we go, it's the time for the elite men. They're all lining up. Again, there's plenty of them. I reckon at least 30 in this elite men's race. For about two minutes until they start. What are you doing there, mate? <laughs> <laughs> Great running, Andy. Good job, mate. Good job. Smashed it, mate. Well done. Excellent stuff, mate. So good, mate. Well done. Good, yeah, happy with that. What did you end up running? Do you know? 28, 25. Nice. 28, 26. Great. Oof. Yeah, that hurt. That's a war move. I felt that early as well. Ouch. I'm delighted with that. Yeah, you did so well, mate. Well done. Yeah, good job. Thank you, mate. So the men's race just finished and we're going to walk around with the microphone, see if we can get a few interviews. Andy Butchard's over here, let's see if we have a little chat. Have you got a few minutes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, how did the race go tonight? Okay. I mean, it's a fun atmosphere, isn't it? Like, it's incredible, yeah. Yeah, I feel like they smashed it. Like, yeah. this is what track needs to be like. Exactly. That's the reason I came down here to experience it. I've heard such good things. And the, yeah, I mean, the race didn't go like as I'd hoped. I mean, I wanted to run a bit faster, but like, yeah. hey, these things happen and fitness is in a good place, just one of these days. Yeah, incredible. What was the atmosphere like out there tonight? It's nuts. It's nuts. It's like to, to have that many people in such a small little arena. I mean, honestly, like I don't want to beep anything, but it's it on like other meets. Like yeah, yeah. if this was how we bring the sport forward, this yeah. is definitely it. 100. percent Yeah. Yeah. Well, great run tonight. Thanks Thank for you. spending some time. And yeah, yeah, enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you. Cheers, mate. I'm at the finish line with Jack. How did you get on tonight? Uh, so I think it was about. I think I was fourth in the British champs. Really good, man. So, so good. yeah. Just lost out on Ellis in the sprint finish, but yeah. 28, 27. Awesome, PB or? Yeah, PB by about 20 seconds. Well, so, really good going. yeah, unfortunately, seven seconds off the uh, qualifying time for the European Cup. Right, okay, so, yeah, yeah. Uh, tantalizingly close to that, but yeah, the group didn't really want to force it on, and yeah. I was conscious I was taking on quite a bit of work, and yeah. it was just like maybe I should have committed earlier, but. Yeah. You know, great race, amazing atmosphere, and PB, so yeah. never be disappointed with PB. Let's get a bit of Jerry Sun action. Jerry, 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 have you got a few seconds? How did you find that? The race? The oh, race. yeah, it was fun, it's man. Insane, right? Yeah, it was so fast. Get some good shots? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. I can't wait to see the result, to yeah. be honest. So you're going to be up all night editing those now? There's a possibility. Yeah, yeah. yeah. for sure. <laughs> yeah. Oh, good to see you again, bro. Good to see you too. Yeah, all the best. Paul. Cool. Quick word, how did you find it out there tonight? Uh, it was a pretty good race. Uh, yeah. got, got the win, got the course record, so that's so that was important. Got to be happy with that. And what shoes were you wearing tonight? They, I've not seen those before. Uh, it's Kipron. Kipron, that's, okay. That's my new sponsor, yeah. Oh, amazing. Yeah. 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 And how would you describe the night of the 10,000 PBs in, in one word? Amazing. Amazing, yeah? yeah. And do you think you'll be back next year to defend your, your title? Yeah, uh, definitely. It was a good race and uh, I went for it, got too close to the standard, so I, I got to come back again in future yeah. and, and try to get the standard here. Uh -huh. it's, it's, it's a nice atmosphere to do that. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah thank you very much for your time and uh, enjoy the rest of your evening. Thank you. So there we go, that sums up a pretty crazy evening down here at the night of the 10,000s. I've never seen anything like that before. Um, I definitely will be racing it one year. 
They're just doing the awards in the background, um, I think for the British Championships. And yeah, this just shows you what uh, track racing can be like. It's absolutely incredible. We need more of uh, this in the sport, more events, more companies like ON putting on events that of this scale that just bring together so many different people from around the world. So yeah, thanks for having me. Uh, incredible event. We're going to go over to the presentations now and uh, soak up some of the celebrations. But yeah, aspire to run, run to inspire, and we'll see you again soon. It's been an absolutely fantastic night. A big thank you to Ben and all his team.